everyone, my name is Jenny. I'm the product manager of the 8-bit microcontroller. And today the video's topic is about the low power 8051 microcontroller. Today we're going to introduce the, our latest products, ML54 and ML56 series. Those series are including the LCD driver and also the touch key functions in the microcontroller. So let's move on. This is the Nuvertons 8051 microcontroller family. We divide it into two series. The first one is the industrial grade microcontroller MS51. And the other one is the low power series ML54 and also ML56 series. Those new products are built in with the touch key and also the LCD drivers. And we support up to 64 kilobyte flash, high density flash, and also the up to 4 kilobytes SRAM. And all of our 8051 family, we adopt the 1T8051 core and we provide high noise immunity. For the ESD human body mode, we can support up to 8 kilovolt. And for the EFT, we can support up to 4.4 kilovolt. And all the products we manufacture for the minus 40 up to 105 degree operating temperature. Okay, let's see our ML51 series product portfolio. As you can see that the ML51 series, we provide three different kind of flush size, up to 64 kilobyte flush. And for the package, we provide multiple of package size, uh, such as the MSOP 10 and TSOP 20, and the maximum one is the LQP 64. And we divide it into the baseline and with the LCD driver, which call ML54 series. With the LCD driver and the touch key, we call the ML56 series. Let's see our ML51 features. All of the products we support up to 24 megahertz core speed. And the HRC precision is up to 4% and which is be no problem for the UR transmission in within the all temperature and also the all voltage range. In this series, we support up to four sets of UART and up to 12 channels of PWN. And this PWN is enhanced PWN, which supports complementary output and also the dead zone insertion, so which is be very useful in the LCD control or the, um, or the motor control. And we have put a hardware RTC inside our 8051 series, so which can realize the calendar functions. In the analog part, we put the LCD driver. The most one we can support up to 8COM with the 28 segments. And we have the up to 13 channels of the capacitive touch. And the band gap in the ADC, we can support within 1% precision to judge the VDD voltage. Nuvatan has very broad scalability can see from the 8051 low power ML51, ML54, and ML56 series. With the same package, we can move between different kind of series, such as the 32-bit M031 or the low power M251 series. And also the very high performance M480s we can support. Just the hardware, we are supported with the pin-to-pin -pin function, but also the software API, we can also support pin-to-pin. -pin. Okay. Here is the power modes of the ML51 series. The first one, we have the normal run mode. In the normal run mode, which clock, the CPU clock runs at the HRC, the 24 megahertz, and we can support the power consumption with the 80 microamp per megahertz. In the low power run mode, the CPU is still working with the LIRC, the low, low frequency RC oscillator, or the low frequency crystals. Then the power consumption is about the 15 microamp. In the power down mode with RTC on, the power consumption is about 1.7 microamp. On the first one, we can support up to 224 segments. For the backplane, we can support up to backplanes, and the segment we can support up to 28. For the voltage levels, we can have different kind of bias, the one, two, one third, and also the one for driving the LCD driver. 
we provided three different kind of voltage generation methods. The first one is the charge pump method, which can be used to stabilize the voltage so it will not be affects even the battery power drop. The second one is the internal resistor division. For this kind of voltage generation, it's very common be using for the small panels that usually be driving LCD voltage. And the third one, we provide a capacity split method. The capacitor, which build in the OP buffer. So this kind, with this kind of mode, we have stronger uh, driving ability. So even the five inch or six inch, this kind of big size panel can be used to drive by this kind of capacitor split method. Okay, let's introduce our touch key features. In the right side of this picture, you can see we provide up to 13 different kind of touch keys. And we have support the on-panel ITO sensors, up to five different kind of sensor. And in the PCB, we support up to eight PCB sensors. Each touch key with the different kind of threshold and the calibrations. Novatum provide not only the hardware, the GUI developing tool, which can automatically generate the touch key parameters, but also we provide a mass production tool. In the mass production tool, we can optimize the not only the algorithm, but also the parameters of the touch keys. And we provide different kinds of software solution, uh, like the single key or the multi key sliders, rotators that can be found in our BSP. Knows that the layout guide of the touch key is very, very important. So we have the documents that teach our customer how to use the electrodes and also the traces of our layout. What is the target applications that ML56 is going to target? The first one is the home appliance of the HMI, such as the smart home appliance air purifier, which can be found with the very fancy touch key and also the very small different kind of icons in the HMI. The second one is like the workout machines and also the massage chair that have different kind of HMI and the single color LCD panels on these kind of machines. The third one is the thermostate. The thermostates are very common to be used either in house or in the building that can control the humidity and also the thermal, the temperature of by this kind of thermostate. The first is the industrial control that in different kind of devices that need automatically generate or different kind of menu by this kind of HMI. The fifth one is the medical related products. This kind of product such as the thermometer or the blood glucose meters that can be very common to see the independent LCD drivers on this kind of applications. The last one is the handheld meters. In the handheld meters that are going to be used to measure um, either the distance or the different kind of speed that can be used for this kind of meters. So all of these products are very common and can be used by our ML51 series to develop. Okay, so this is all of our content to date. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, you can subscribe to Nubotan's channels. We will have much more updated events that are going to publish on our YouTube channel. Thank you for your watching. See you next time. Bye.